Hi buddy, welcome back to Answers Q. In this video, we'll see about a free training program that is offered by Amazon Web Services through which you can learn about a lot of things related to cloud computing with a focus on AWS. So before we see that, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, kindly do that first. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon that appears after that so you'll get a notification whenever we upload a video like this. And you can also join our Telegram channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook. I'll give you all those links in the description. Do check it out. And here's a small update regarding Coursera. So Coursera is a very good e-learning platform where you can get courses from 275 plus leading universities and companies like Google, Meta, Amazon, Duke University, Stanford University, HEC Paris, or John Hopkins University. So a lot of top most companies and universities in the world are offering online courses across different categories like data science, business or computer science through this Coursera e-learning platform. So if you want to purchase any course in Coursera instead of buying a single course, you can opt for Coursera Plus. Because with Coursera Plus subscription, you can get un unlimited access to 7000 plus courses. And in addition to that, you can also get hands-on projects and job ready certification programs that are offered by some big companies like Google. So if you are interested in this, just check out the link in description and get Coursera Plus. So now let's move on and see about the free AWS uh, training program. So Amazon Web Services Cloud Practitioner Essentials Day is going to be conducted on August 14th of 2023. So this is a free training program where you can learn a lot of things related to cloud computing or in particular focus with AWS. And this is going to be conducted on August 14th, like I said, but it will be Monday. And 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. IST is the timing given for it. So if you are from any other country other than India, just convert this to your local time zone. And this is a fundamental course where you can learn everything about AWS Cloud. They have mentioned that here. This is for anyone who wants to learn about AWS Cloud in general. And this course will give you an overview of uh, cloud concepts, AWS services, security, architecture, pricing and support. So you can learn about all these different things about AWS. And whatever you learn in this course will also help you prepare for AWS Certified Cloud Practitioner exam. So that is also mentioned here. So all these are benefits for you. And in addition to this, you're also going to get free access to five foundational AWS Builder Labs. And this is for a limited time after the event. So you can see here, they'll also provide this free access. So you'll receive a link to access the labs for free during the event. So if you participate in it, you're also going to get this for free in addition to whatever you learn in this program. So if you are wondering what you can learn in this particular program, they have also given what are the topics which are going to be covered. So you can see that here. So you will get to learn about everything around AWS. You will learn about the difference between on-premises, hybrid cloud and all-in cloud. You will get to learn about the benefits of AWS cloud. You will get to learn about the basic global infrastructure of the AWS cloud. You will also uh, learn about the AWS core services like compute, network, databases and storage. You'll learn about AWS well-architected framework. You'll learn about the responsibility model. You'll learn about the core uh, security services within the AWS cloud. Basics of AWS cloud migration will also be covered. And they're also going to let you know about the financial benefits for an organization if they are willing to use AWS cloud. So that is also going to be covered. You can get to learn about the core billing account management and pricing models inside it. And you'll learn how to use those pricing tools to make cost-effective choices for AWS services. So all these topics are going to be covered in this particular course. And anyone who is interested in learning about the AWS Cloud can attend this program. There is no restriction to it because anyone can register in it. And they haven't given any information regarding the certificate here. But if you want to learn these things, you can just go ahead and register for this free training event and learn from it. And now let me tell you how you can register for this AWS Cloud Practitioner Essentials Day. So just uh, click on the link in description, go through all the details, come to this page. And here on the right side, you will see here a, a form. So you can just fill it out, give your email address, first name, last name, give your phone number, company name. If you're a student, you can just type in student and just select your country, industry, usage. So answer all these questions. If you are new to this and if you do not know what to select here, you can just go with any option. So just uh, fill out the form and click on this uh, submit button and register for this AWS Cloud Practitioner Essential Stay program. And if you are doing it on a personal level, you can see here there will be a section like I am completing this form in connection with my personal interest. So you can just select that and fill out all the details here and click on the register button. That is the submit button and register for the AWS Cloud Practitioner Essential Stay. So it's a very simple registration process after you complete it you will get a mail from Amazon Web Services. It will contain all the details. So you can just follow those instructions and attend the event on mentioned date and time. 
and learn about AWS and a lot of cloud concepts around it. So I hope you'll find this AWS Cloud Practitioner Essential Stay program very useful. If you want to get more updates about online courses or events like this, do subscribe to AnswersQ and press the bell icon so that you'll get a notification whenever we upload a video like this.